We understand that uh, the returning officer, Mr. Yamami, is approaching the road election podium. election 2013. Result for the Electoral Division of Pongo East. Kenneth Andrew Jayaratnam, the Reform Party, 353 votes. Ko Po Kun, People's Action Party, 12,856 votes. Li Li Lian, the Workers' Party, 16,038 votes. Desmond Lim Bak Chuan, Singapore Democratic Alliance, 168 votes. Rejected votes, 417. Total votes cast, 29,832. The local votes counted for the Electoral Division of Pongo East are conclusive of the results. Pursuant to Section 49, Subsection 7E, Paragraph A of the Parliamentary Elections Act, I declare Li Li Lian of the Workers' Party as the candidate elected for the Electoral Division of Pongo East. Well, this is a historic day indeed for Workers' Party. Um, the supporters here in Hogang, they're chanting the party's name and they're just absolutely exuberant. Of course, this just means that the Workers' Party has one more candidate in Parliament and Li Li Lian is, of course, also the first women opposition candidate to have won a single member constituency since 1965. And she's the second opposition women in parliament as well so a victory for the workers party um, this is the second time uh, that the workers party has uh, arrested control of a, a seat from the ruling people's action party if you remember the last general election the workers party too took control of uh, aljunit grc from the pap so as an uh, as a member of parliament for pungol east Ms. Lee has said that her immediate task would see to the uh, would be to see to the smooth running of the uh, Pungol East Town Council. She's also pledged to look into uh, some of the amenities for residents there, uh, looking into more childcare centres in the estate, uh, more hawker centres, for example. She's also said that she wants to be a strong alternative voice in Parliament, raising national issues uh, such as the plight of uh, young families in Singapore and also the elderly. So Miss um, Lee definitely has a, a lot, uh, a, a lot to prepare as she enters Parliament. Back to you in the studio. All right, thank you. Let's uh, have another look at the results that was just announced. Of course, uh, the winning party, Workers' Party, with its candidate Miss Li Li Lian. Now these are the four candidates that had uh, contested, and these were the vote, uh, the vote numbers for each party with uh, Ms. Li Li Lian garnering 54.52% of the votes, uh, followed by the PAP's 43.71%. Now, if you remember, Ms. Uh, Li Li Lian garnered 16,038 votes uh, compared to the PAP's 12,856. Uh, from the PAP, there's a difference of about 3,182 votes between the two um, top uh, Candidates, of course, the Reform Party with 353 votes and the Singapore Democratic Alliance with 168 votes, which means that the candidates from these two parties would have lost their election deposits.